بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول ہائی لائٹ سکس بگ ریزنز دیٹ وائی پیپلز آر ناٹ گیٹنگ انٹرویو کالس اینڈ آئی ول ایکسپلین یو پریکٹیکلی دیٹ ہاؤ ٹو ریکٹیفائی دیم آلسو سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ ود دا ریزن نمبر ون دا ریزن نمبر ون از یور سی وی از ان ریلیونٹ اور ناٹ کسٹمائز according to the posted job so if your cv is irrelevant or not customized as per the job description posted on advertisement it will make you out of the game your original cv is not one size fits all documents you have to do 20 to 25 percent customization for each job posting to make it relevant for example you are a general accountant and you have correlated your cv according to that and an advertisement comes with the post of account receivable accountant what you will do is it right to send them your general accountant correlated cv or it is better to customize it according to the job posting if you want an interview call then customize it according to the job description so you need to add those keywords which are mentioned on advertised job description like this is a job hunting website bait.com and if you write here accountant and in saudi arabia and click on search job and here you will see the chief account if you click on it you can see here job descriptions modify your cv according to these keywords which are mentioned here what they are looking for so if you will do your cv like this not exactly same like this if this sentence contains some responsibilities you need to t take out those responsibilities and write yourself that you can do this job and when recruiter will open your cv and he will found your skills according to the job requirements then he will definitely call you for an interview let's move ahead to the reason number two the reason number two is your non-professional cv your cv is your brand ambassador its sole objective is to make you shortlisted in the first round your cv has less than 10 seconds to sell you so your cv has to be tidy and should highlight your elevator's pitch in a compelling way if your cv is lousy in presentation and shallow in substance you have no chance for the interview try to get cv writing services from an expert i know it will cost you little but i'm sure you will get calls for interview for example this person this gorilla cv writers they are selling the cv services and the writer is your cv worthy of job interview calls we will evaluate your cv free of charge so contact them and send them your cv and they will evaluate it and after that they will reply you and they will modify your cv in a cheaper cost and i'm sure i'm 100% sure that you will be able to get a call for an interview let's move ahead to the reason number 3 which is spellings or grammatical mistake a single spelling mistake and grammatical error can put off the recruiter and you will be ignored while scanning through the cvs recruiters one finger is always on delete button so make sure that your cv is free from spelling and grammatical mistakes when you write your cv please show your cv to someone who is professional in your social circle the reason number 4 is not following the job posting instructions what it means it means that you have not followed instruction of job posters like here if we write here accountant okay chief account search a job and if we go through any of 
anyone. You can see here the job details. What it says, they are looking for a full-time employee. If you are looking for a part-time job, so you should not apply for this job. And if you are looking for a monthly salary more than this, so you should not apply for this job. Also, if instruction says write name of position in the subject line and you did not, so why a recruiter should bother to take extra pain and download and open your CV and then decide where to save it? If instruction says explain the reason in favor of your candidature while you write only one sentence, my CV is attached. Your chances of being called for interview will shrink. So make sure to send your CV as per the job instructions. The reason number five is your home address. If your address at your CV is of another city, your chances of initial selection are minimum. Why a recruiter sitting in Jeddah and having position in Jeddah should call a person from the mom for the job interview? Unless your skill set is absolutely unique, in this case, only unique quality people are called for interview or the company doesn't have any other option for the certain position. Like this job location is in Uber. Okay, if a person living in Jeddah and applying for this job, so this thing will make a very little chance for the call for an interview. Let's move to another reason, which is the reason number six, your CV picture. It is always advised to job hunters to put professional picture on CV. If your picture is non-professional, you will be discriminated. Hire a professional photographer and get as many as shots and select the best one. Invest in your image. Like if you open the Google and if you write here how the CV picture look like. How should the CV photo look like? Click on it. As you can see here, they said frame from the waist up, dress professionally here and makeup should be neutral. Keep facial expressions and has gestures neutral. Avoid props, think passport photo, not Facebook selfie. Ask someone to help. So if you see these pictures, or you will get an idea like this picture is looking very nice. He is smiling and this picture is very nice looking so you can get an idea the picture which has a professional or the general smile with looking teeth like cheese so that picture will look very nice on your cv so the bottom line is invest some time before you apply for any job read carefully the job poster instructions and customize your cv accordingly Best of luck.